the 2000s. Oh. What a wonderful time to be alive. Oh, oh yeah. Love the 2000s. <laughs> I was born, like, <laughs> in 2000. <laughs> it was exciting, especially for television. So, what 2000s TV shows do you remember? Danny Phantom. Okay. Hannah Montana. Okay. iCarly, SpongeBob. The Amanda Show. Yeah. After Last Airbender. Oh, okay. the delicious. Malcolm in the Middle, is that 2000s? Even Stevens. Yeah. <gasps> Victorious! <laughs> We're going to react to 10 2000s TV shows that you forgot about. Ah. Oh, oh we forgot. Got up, but we probably did. I'm sure I'll recognize the couple. I'm gonna try. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna oh, do punked. something. Oh, punked. Is this punked? <laughs> oh, this is where they prank all of like the um, stars and artists. I love Ashton Kutcher. <laughs> then we're gonna laugh at them. I remember the Beyonce no, one. No, no. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that stash. You want the farmhand? Well, you got it. It's all next on Haunt. Ashton Kutcher just spending a whole day in that like one little space, be like, dude, the episode with Justin Timberlake, the IRS comes and they're like, you didn't pay your taxes and stuff, and he's like, what? And then like they pull out this guitar, they're like, is this valuable? And he's like, yeah, that's valuable. And he's like, steps on it, and he's like, oh, I'm sorry, dude. He's like crying, he's in tears, he's like on the phone with his mom. He's like, wow, they're taking all my stuff. Like it's so funny. Yeah. Beyonce never loses. Oh my God, the tree, the tree. The tree. So she had to put this like to the to the like the tree on top of this Christmas what the angel star an angel or something on top of the tree and the tree fall collapses in front of a crowd. She's just sitting there with the with the star. And the kids go, "You ruined Christmas." And she just goes, "Yeah." Would you ever appear on Punk? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I would love to act on a prank show. Like I would love to be one of the prankers. I wouldn't mind it. Yeah. I would have to be like the actor and not the one getting pranked. Oh, okay. This was like a very big prank show. It ran from 2003 to 2007. The show began as a non-celebrity prank show developed by Ashton Kutcher and MTV. It was called Harassment um, and it quickly ran into disaster when a 2002 prank involving a dead body resulted in a $10 million lawsuit. What? Uh, wait, a dead what? body? Mm -hmm. Who could have foreseen? Wow, get that money though. Yeah. Get the bag. <laughs> the show focuses mainly on the life of a junior high school student and their two friends as they try to become more than social geeks. Is this Lizzie McGuire? It's not. Freaks and geeks. It is not. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. It's not Ed. No. It's this is show. a cartoon. This was found on Nickelodeon. Oh, it's oh. a cartoon. It's a cartoon. The main character was a girl. The I'm girl's like, name starts with a, a G. Does that help you? G. 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 No. Not G. G. <laughs> what if I told you that the main character's name is Ginger? Someone once told me the grass you got is much it. greener. What is that show name? Uh, uh, as told by Ginger. Yeah! Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> Woo! Uh, as life as told by Ginger? Yes, yes. Uh, that was that it. I love that Whoa. show. Yes. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. Um, as told by Ginger, ate that <laughs> up. I loved that show. Someone once told me. Oh, oh yes, yes. yes. Okay, I've never seen the show, but I know what it is because I used to play Seen It on Nickelodeon. Like seen Nickelodeon Seen mm -hmm. It. Oh! Yeah! Yeah! Fre oh. Her friends are awful! They just put smog all over her face. Where are these cookie boys? I know. <laughs> <laughs> me. <laughs> me. No, I just don't know why that car like zoomed away and blew all that smoke into the poor kids' faces. <laughs> My mom was was having car issues. Look, I mean, like, yeah, well, then, yeah, you see, I mean, you see, hold on, you see the tow truck, uh, and then yeah. like her car. Hi, like, how are, are you? <laughs> <laughs> Breathe it in, kids. <laughs> Breathe it in. <laughs> Everyone started to sing that way at like one point in their life. I said, <laughs> How long do we think this show was on the air? I want to say like a good ten years. You think ten, ten years? years? No way. Like three. Five. At least like years. six years. Six years. Four. Girl, it was six years. <laughs> It started in 2000 and it ended in 2006. Wow. wow. I, I thought it was like short lived. No, six years. Six years. That's six a lot. Years. Wow. What are you doing? 
Don't touch me! Don't house! Touch me. House MD! House. Oh, house. Oh, I loved house. I can name it. It is house. Okay. Mm. Oh, yeah. You know what? He was kind of hot. Like, I don't know. Everyone in this it's, show is kind of hot. Babe. Her hernia can wait. Help! They're trying to kill me! Okay. He knew everything. He's now. rough around the edges, but he's right. Mm -hmm. like, always right. <laughs> This is a hospital and we're all dressed like doctors and there are easier ways. I love how He's house. such a sassy <laughs> Well, apparently in ERs, they do monologues to lecture everybody about what they should have been doing <laughs> while they're dying at the same time. Oh! This <laughs> And then you just pull it out, it's a taper! <laughs> He's so good in he that role. He was like really, yeah. Was... I thought it was so cool. It was very dramatic for no reason, mm -hmm. but I would love to watch it. But it was like they just kept pulling you. Because the tapeworm eats what you do as well. Yeah, bro. But it also eats you. Yeah. Only four years after House aired, it became the most watched fiction show in the world. Whoa. Whoa. Um, 2008 marked its largest audience. It like was like around 81.8 million viewers that year in 2008. Wow. Wow. 81 point, that's wow, that's, that's a, a lot, lot of people. Wow. That's a lot Good of people. grief. Yeah. And I remember I was so creeped out by him because he never blinks. <laughs> he he's never very intense. blinks, he never blinks. Like even when you look at that, or maybe he's blinking when I'm blinking, I don't know. <laughs> <but> <laughs> Perfectly sync up your blinks. We're syncing our blinks. Jake is keeping a secret from his teachers and classmates. He's a descendant of dragons. Oh my god, he's got like black spiky hair. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know what he looks like. Mm -hmm. Jake. Jake, Jake Long. Jake Long. And um, my mysterious, nope. Jake Long and something dragon. Jake Long. You got and, it. And fight something. Jake Long. I know that's his name. Uh, JD. Jake yeah. Dragon. Jake Long. American Dragon, Jake yeah. Long. There you go. <laughs> yes. American Dragon. Dragon, dra dra dragon, dragon, uh. dragon. Oh, Jake Long. Uh, okay. Jake Long. Oh, Jake yes. Long, yes. American Dragon. The there Jake it is. Long. American Dragon, dragon what? Jake, Jake Long. Long. American Dragon, Jake Long. American Dragon Warrior. Okay. Yes, it Absolutely. is such a good show. It is so good. So good. You guys oh used to watch God. the show? I did. I, yeah, yeah, I had I such a crush it. on so him good. as a kid. <laughs> that theme song was good. It really? Was so good. Wait, let me hear it. With his dragon powers, dragon deed, dragon tail, born of dragon fire. Check this out, G. Drag it up, yo! Oh, he literally turns into a dragon. A dragon. Yeah, okay, you see how he's buff? Oh, cool. I'm not only ready to fly, I'm ready to fly. Damn, Dante Basco had a good career when it came to voice acting. I'm saying. He was in a lot of good ones. Yeah. Yeah, because the American dragon is in the house. In the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, I'm cool, no problem. Uh, could, could you guys a little help down here? <laughs> he fights ninjas and his like love interest. He doesn't know it's actually a ninja, and she has to fight against him. It's uh, ah, yeah, layers. He, Asian dragons don't have wings, <laughs> so I guess he is the American, American dragon. dragon. <laughs> American. Chris and Steve Ella had a show called Wild Boys. Have you heard of that show? Wild Boy? No, I don't remember that. Hey, it sounds, Wild this sounds Boys. very familiar. They go around to like different nature stuff, and then they would like jump in like the water with sharks. I saw them. They doing crazy things. I'm like, okay. That's pretty cool. Like a travel show. Yeah! Check it out. It's a young snapping turtle. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, oh, no! Yeah. Snapping turtle. Let's take a closer look. Oh, no. <gasps> no! Okay, so ah! 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 <laughs> Oh, it's not Jackass? It's not Jackass. CKY was the show they did before. Oh, is it? Is it Bam Margera? <laughs> so that's why they call him a snapping turtle. Really? <laughs> that's the funny one. That's the, the most... What's this guy's name? Oh, his name is Manny. Manny. <laughs> <laughs> this is Wild Boys. Wild Boys. Wild oh, I couldn't Boys. remember the name of it. Yes, I do remember this, though. Do you guys remember Nintendo DS? Yes. They they did a promo for for Nintendo. Oh my God. The Wild Boys said they were gonna battle it out in the African plains. A lot of people said. It. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, okay. With wireless multiplayer and loads of other cool stuff, allowing us to be as wild as we want to be. <laughs> oh hell no. Oh. Oh. Touching is good. <laughs> Oh that can't be God. real, right? Oh, it was That's real. real. It was real. You know he was freaking out. He was like, oh, wait, guys, 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 cut, 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 cut. Was Lions Crime left a tree like that? Mm. Dude, I'd be petrified. That lion was not supposed to jump up. <laughs> really? And then they were just like, oh, zoom in, zoom in, zoom, zoom in. Zoom, and he was just like, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. <gasps> 
Dude, I don't know how they're still alive with half the shit. That they was eat. not planned. Terrifying. How long do you think it was on air? How many years? I want to say like two years. Three four years? Yeah, three, four. <laughs> okay. Three. It was on for a bit, like five years. I'm gonna give three. I'm gonna guess three years, and then they were like, we're gonna go back to the movies now. Yeah. <laughs> Chris, you got it. It's three years. Three years. It was from 2003 to 2006. This one is trivia. Zac Efron appeared on what 2000s dating show? Was it Parental Control, Next, Temptation Island, or Room Raiders? Oh, it's I, Next. I think it's, I I think think it's, it's next. next. Yeah. I'm gonna pick next. I'm gonna say next. Okay. Although parental control seems maybe. I'm gonna go with B. I'll go D just to be different. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna stick with parental yeah, control. Yeah, I'm gonna go with parental control. It sounds like something reality TV show producers would be like, wouldn't it be so funny if they went on a blind date and surprise, it's Zac, Zac Efron! Efron. <laughs> you both are incorrect. <laughs> ah. <laughs> next is not the answer. You guys are incorrect. <laughs> was it Room Raiders? It was Room oh. Raiders. Oh, that was the other one. Trust your instincts. That was the other one. Trust your gut. It was D. It was Room Raiders. Ah. <laughs> You're on Room Raiders. No. Come on. What do you mean, no? This is so funny. Come on, the show starts now. Oh my god. This is like show human starts now. <laughs> Get in the van. <laughs> Jesus. That's Literally, intense. put you in a van and just takes off. I say, good luck. Ladies. Yeesh. Oh my god. My name's Zac Efron from the TV show Summerland. Yeah. By the end of the day, I have to choose one of you to accompany me on a date. No anyway, way. Let's check out in the drawer. <laughs> right, a junk drawer. Yes. That's essential, okay? I don't go. <laughs> you need a junk drawer. What's an ooh? Condom. <gasps> Zac oh, Efron. Sexually active. Easy access. Easy access. <laughs> Zac Efron. Why do you know what those are? <laughs> Can you really judge someone based off of their, their bedrooms and what it looks like? I'm curious. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, you like Legos? All right, we're definitely going on a Would you have wanted to peer on room <laughs> No. No, I don't want that guy from going through Get my Get out of my drawer. room. <laughs> How long do you think the show was on air? Six years? No. No, more? Probably less. I'm gonna give it like four. four. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Exactly what I was gonna say. Two years. Two years. A month. A year. <laughs> yeah, I wanna say like as short as a show can be on TV. Uh, it was actually six oh. years. <laughs> So sorry. <laughs> Six years. Yeah. Six years of kidnapping. So finally, someone sued for emotional damage and trauma. They're like, oh, okay, yeah, I guess we yeah, should probably. They said enough yeah. is enough. <laughs> yep, there Nathan it is. Fireman. Space westerns. Tell them the job didn't work out. We're not thieves, but well, we are thieves. Point is, we're not taking what's his. He's, been around, he's in the rookie we'll now. That's, yeah, that's Nathan Fillion. Nathan Fillion. I was like, is that Ashton Kutcher? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Josh Whedon. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's canceled now. It doesn't matter where you go. I did like the Nevers, though. Why? I want you down. Oh? And the last thing you see will be my blade. Kill him. Oh. Uh huh. Darn. Darn. Oh! <laughs> Uh, and brought in the guy to kill. This is all the money Niska oh, gave us in advance. Oh, good. Let's speak for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> the next day is like 100%. I'm on board. Yep, 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 yep. Do not kick me into the space. With the show being canceled, it kind of became a cult classic, kind of like Freaks and Geeks. Yeah. So they uh, made it into a movie called Serenity. Serenity, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, it developed into comics and role playing games and. Cause it's just so cool. It's like space western. That's so cool. Oh, Rugrats. No, no. Rugrats yeah. the adult years, the college years, <laughs> yeah. the high school After years. After Ginger. Oh, that. No, 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 no. No, that's um. Wild Thornberries. No. <laughs> oh, um, uh, Rugrats. But what, what Rugrats in college or what the hell? Rugrats adults. All grown up. Rugrats. Oh, <laughs> that was it. All grown up. All grown oh, up. All grown up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Although they say all grown up and they're in what middle high school? Yeah. <laughs> it's um grown up. It's when they're all grown up though. Yeah. yeah Rugrats, the new class. <laughs> new Rugrats. The new class. All grown up. It's like it, it's you. You couldn't have all grown up without the original Rugrats. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, are we in the nude? In the buff? Oh, <laughs> hi there. <laughs> <laughs> he still sounds just like Chucky. Yeah. He's just so neurotic. His pasty white. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. 
<laughs> oh, okay. Fainted. Well, yeah. Fainted. <laughs> Fainted. Someone stole his clothes. He has it's to hide, hide behind, behind a, a guitar. guitar. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, so that's where the naked cowboy came from in New York. Huh? There was an episode in Rugrats where they launched themselves forward in time. If you, they like went went into a closet, and that was like the introduction to all grown ups. Like they they turned into like teenagers for like a whole entire episode. Oh, and I bet you everybody okay. loved it so and everybody much. Everybody loved it so much that they were like, "Hey, we're gonna do an actual like sequel to this," and it was called All Grown Up. If you were watching it as like a kid, you mm -hmm. actually grew up with the characters. So that's why a lot of people were like, "Oh, I can relate to this because now I'm I'm that age of being in school and all that stuff." This one was only on for a year until it got canceled. So guess this show. Congratulations, everybody. Oh. You're all of age. Freaks and Geeks, right? Yeah. Wait, this was only a year? Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Freaks and Geeks. Yeah. Yeah. That was only a year? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's Jesus. It's your new identity. Tell me that picture doesn't look like you. Jason Schwartzman, I love it. This picture doesn't look like me, man. Jason Schwartzman? Oh yeah, Schwartzman. Does, man. Wait, says I'm 29. Like a Jason Siegel as well. Yeah, mine says I'm 34. I have no problems. So that's fine. It's phenomenal. Just give us the money back. Oh my God, is that Jason Siegel? Yeah. <laughs> they're definitely over 19. N no, they're in high school, oh, man. High school. The series was canceled after airing 12 out of their 18 episodes. Oops. So they didn't even get to finish. Mm -mm. The theme of Freaks and Geeks, it just reflects like the sad, hilarious, like unfairness of teen life, basically. It became a cult classic. Yeah. It did. Yeah. And Judd Apatow, who was like, continued the show's legacy by incorporating a lot of the actors that you saw in like future productions. So. Yes. In all of his future productions, I feel like. Yeah. Well, they're all like name. They're big like, names now. Yeah, yeah big, big names. names. Oh, what the f <laughs> what was this? I've never I was seen like, that oh, new girl. Life. I saw the bangs in my. I went All new right, girl. I was thinking new girl too, but. But why are we doing. Not Boston Public. Not <laughs> Boston Public. <laughs> that I definitely don't know. This is Kristen Chenoweth, by the way. Yeah. What type of show are we getting from this picture? Comedy? Comedy. Yeah, like, mm -hmm. I feel like the girl with the eye patch in the back makes me think that it's kind of a comedy. It was about a pie maker with the ability to bring dead things back to life with his touch. Yeah, he, he had like a gift, some magical yeah. power, and like people would like die, and he'd be like, here's some pumpkin pie. Whoop, whoop. Yeah. <laughs> oh, pushing daisies. Yes. Oh, Lee Pace, Kristen Chenoweth. Kristen Chenoweth. Oh, <laughs> this was such a cute show. Pushing daisies. Yes! Yeah! This is Pushing Daisies. Pushing Daisies. Okay. Pushing Daisies. Pushing daisies. Oh, oh, never. I, I remember it. the um, posters for it. Yeah. Like just seeing them around town. Yeah, yeah. This is the story of a pie maker named Ned, who, since he could remember, had a gift of sorts. It was said, Boop. first touched by Ned. Must have slipped. Would find. He's like a necromancer. Okay. Wait, is his mom just dying in front of him? Oh. Dead oh, again. Sh you would be forever dead. <gasps> oh. Oh, so you can't touch them again. Traumatic. Yeah. Love Charlotte suddenly passed. 60 seconds. <laughs> oh. 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 Who are you? And make it fast. <laughs> you were my first kiss. You were my oh. first kiss, too. Never record Christmas music behind it. You didn't have to be dead. Well, that'd be preferable. <laughs> If he can't touch them again? You touch murder victims, you ask who killed them, you touch them again, they go back to being dead, and then you collect the reward? That's it in a nutshell. Hey, that's the way to do it! <laughs> a bag is a bag! Yeah! But the... Is her name Daisy? <laughs> oh, that's right! <laughs> so he has to show her affection through uh, other, other people? people. <laughs> so he can't touch his girl again? No, Cause then she'll can't. die! Then she'll die. It only ran for two seasons. It's uh, like a two-seasoner. 2007 to 2009. Vita, would, are you interested in watching this show if it ever came I, out? Because I, <laughs> your face is kind of... No, it's so weird Ooh. to me. I think it is really weird, and it's kind of just like, okay. I might watch it. I think yeah. I'd watch it for a second. <laughs> <laughs> the whole one season. <laughs> the whole one season. It, again, if it was on... I'll see an episode, see yeah. how I feel. I could have an edible and see a couple episodes. So. <laughs> that was the end of our episode for today. How was this experience going down memory lane? This was really fun. This was Revisiting, really fun. like, Revisiting, the past. Revisiting, unlocking memories. Unlocking memories. Loved. Yeah, Trip down memory lane. Yeah. Pushing Daisies really was like... Very nostalgic. Yeah. yeah. It reminds me of all these things I grew up watching, and uh -huh. I, I want to revisit some of these. I, I just want to watch American Dragon <laughs> again. Like, that makes me really want to watch it again. <laughs>
It makes me want to go watch Firefly. As, as told by Ginger, <laughs> like that one surprisingly people yeah. forget about, but it's still like really chill opening. Yeah. I'd probably tune in for a little bit of Wild Boys because Steve Steve is sober now, so we'll see if yeah. he does those crazy stunts yeah. like he used to. <laughs> Thanks for watching this episode. What was your favorite show from the 2000s? Let us know in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe for more React videos. Bye. 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 Bye.